Greetings everybody, this is Grizzly Bear 92 here and welcome back to Contrast Episode 2. Hopefully this one goes well and hopefully it doesn't freeze. My editing software is being a piece of shit. Because, uh, well it keeps showing the water bug of course, but that's because I need to just get a new one. But um, yeah, you guys keep seeing the end of my, keep seeing my um, desktop at the end of each recording because it's not letting me get rid of it and basically stop the recording while I'm in game. I don't know what's going on there. Big piece of crap. Anyway, let's just continue. I do apologize, but let's just carry on oh, with the story. It's locked. Hopefully it goes well. Oh wait! Didn't I just I told you I was time. good at fixing things. <sighs> Criminal breaking and entering terrible DD. Where did you learn this? Was it me? I think it was me. Maybe you could find another way in. Of course. This one we need to make a passage with the people. Ugh, there we go. Now, lady, gotta move. We need you about. I think. I think that should be alright, actually. Um. Yeah. If I'm yeah, all right, this works as well. We'll go this way instead because I think if we go the other way, the light. I don't know if there's music in this part. Hang on a minute. And that should be. There's no music on this part actually. It's just all quiet. But um, hopefully in the next part there is a collectible here. And uh, once you're up here. Sneaky, sneaky. Uh, this is the part it froze on when I got down here and I watched the. Uh, I think it was not this cutscene, but the, the cutscene immediately after this, which uh, screwed me over. Hopefully it goes alright. What are you doing here? You're not supposed to be <sighs> out this way. Where's your mom? Fuck up game. Did mommy really kick you out. Were you spying on us at the cabaret? Yes. Are you coming home? <laughs> That's my plan. I've got to convince your mother. She here? No, I snuck out. <laughs> oh boy, you're growing up fast. You used to be scared of the dark. I'd be proud what, of did her. Did she really kick you I out? Snuck out. Well, what? Yeah, kinda. Terrible. At the time, I wasn't being very good to her, so I guess I had it coming. I missed you so much. Oh, I missed you too, honey. But I'm gonna come back home. I'm putting together a circus. See, it's gonna pay for everything. And you know who it's gonna star? The Me. amazing Vincenzo. <laughs> hey, How snooping around of you. I'm the doing? acrobat. Yeah, it's gonna star the amazing Vincenzo. He's good, huh? Look, you're really not supposed to be out this late. I'm, I'm gonna take you home. I brought you the milk. Shh, shh, shh. But shh. Uh, I got a couple of investors coming here, wow. and they don't like kids much. That I need you to run home by yourself, not okay? Suspicious. But I you. Didi, you have to get out of here. At all. I won't tell mom you snuck out. Yeah, this is a bit okay, worrying. Go. Very much right, and uh, this is where it started. This is where it hey, froze. Hey, come on, Silvio. Hopefully, it goes okay. His on name the is Salvio. So why are we here? Salvio, yeah. What did I say? I got great news. Vincenzo is in. What did I say? You got him. You're sure? Sure, I'm sure. He's gonna play opening night. Really bring in the crowds. So that's why you brought us here, huh? You're gonna show us his act? Yeah. Yeah, except uh, the projector's broke. Because if you don't got them, your circus is going to flop and you're not going to be able to pay us back. And then I'm going to have to break your arms and then we see how well you swim. Look, I'm going to need just a little more money to uh, finalize things with the chance. Are you kidding me? What'd you spend that money on that suit? Listen, it's all going to come back to you. <clears throat> Show them the movie. Show them the movie. Ah, oh, I didn't freeze, thank God. Quickly. In here. Oh. Get in the wall. Oh, oh, you broke my finger. Oh, fuck. Uh, here we go. Oh, it's not frozen. Oh. Thank God. Hey, knock it off, Sal. Check this out. Geez, he is amazing. I told you I got him. Okay, let's go get your money. Thanks a bunch. Look, why don't I swing by tomorrow and pick it up? Relax. Let's go have a drink, huh? I know a guy who'll fix that finger right I, up. I can't. I gotta go meet someone. Boy, you're in a hurry, huh? She must be a real ripe tomato. Haha. 
You want to go meet Johnny's tomato sal? I like a ripe tomato. That tomato's my wife. Always wanted to meet the wife. Mm -mm. Uh, we'll play canasta. Just the four of us. That's mm -hmm. not good. Okay, but he's not asking Johnny. He's telling. Yeah, you got involved with some very bad people. Very, very bad people. Um, collectibles are nothing. Uh, yeah, he owes the mob money. It's very film noir esque. This kind of stuff always happened, I suppose. But um, I think I can become part of it. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Hey, I was part of the amazing returns act. All right, let's just carry on. Excelsior, that's the hotel. Act one, the problems of three little people. Yeah, there is, get to the Excelsior hotel, yeah. There is only, I believe there is just three acts in this game. But, um, like, as you can see, there's all different, it's like mini chapters all in each act. Like, there was, the third one was a visible friend, and there was, of all the gin joints, now it's, um, the problems of three little people. So, I'm not entirely sure how, I can't remember how, I think there's only, I think there's five in each act, so I think it's like 15. I suppose chapters all together, but um, there's a decent amount of gameplay in this, so where's the Excelsior Hotel, I don't remember. Hang on, hang on, hang on, let me just view that, that is, is gorgeous, I could just, I could stare at this for so long, there's the Excelsior, that crooked building, what the fuck, but um, yeah, this, this world is just so amazing, I just love it, I mean, it's just, it's great. It's such a great game. You should definitely check this out. It's definitely worth it. What is down here? This is the oh, this is the ghost note. Okay, because yeah, this is the bar and stuff that we came up. So it was this way, wasn't it? Oh yeah, next to the the smoke, next to the, the smoking thing. That um, where to get that luminary up there? But uh, this is the next area of the game. Hotel. She was getting pretty loud in there. See? You meet a guy's wife, now he's got a whole new reason to make good. How come you know so much? Cause my ma used to smack me every time I didn't know. Oof. I should try that with my kids. What the fuck? No, you shouldn't. Bastard. How did you get up there already, Didi? Can you fly? I can't get in! The door's locked! I need your help! You freaking got up there already. God. Right, this is the next puzzle area of the game. Get to the fifth floor suites. So... I don't think I remember how to do this part. But, um, we'll give it a go, of course. Just taking a look. That moves the elevators. This gets us up there. Okay. What the fuck is going on here? Ah. Weird. That did something with the shadow. I think we need that shadow, it's what lets us get up there onto the second floor. But, um... Uh oh. Oh, it's a weight. Oh, yeah, now I realize it's. Here we go. Yeah, we need to weigh it down. Oh. The ledges is only the yellow bits, yeah. They glow and such. Um, right, now we're up here. Just taking a look around. Ah yes, we need to do some chandelier platforming here. I don't fully remember. Um, yeah, 
there right above us, the chandeliers. I think we need to go this way. No! That sign. Do not sign the elevators was there for a reason. I think I know what needs to happen. I think I need to be down here again. Yeah, I need to call this down here. Oh god, come on. Game being very glitchy. It wasn't like this last time I played. Hmm. And then do I need to I think I know what I need to do. I think I need to use. <coughs> oh, excuse me. As I die temporarily, I think I need to. I need to use the shadows. Um. Oh no! It. Oh, it's to control the shadows from here. Here we go. But then, how do I? I need to somehow get across here just very quickly. Or do I do this? been that I needed to do this. Um. Oh, and it raises them up. And then if I'm on, I think if I'm on the other side, or with the elevator or something, I can... Yeah, to control that light. Um. Maybe that drags it all the way down again. So... Already stuck. No, because that just shoves me out. Oh, now I'm on the chandelier. Here we go. This, this is what this can happen. I think this is right. Yeah, that's what needed to happen. Oh, that was right. Hooray! Maybe you could sneak in through a window or something. We did it. And then you could let me in. Oh god, my back. Stretching, stretching, stretching. I'm just checking if there's collectibles. I, mean, I seem to be collecting everything even though I said I wasn't going to. Uh, I'm just investigating. So it's a good thing I can dash and just get through areas quickly as well. So it doesn't, it doesn't take too much time. Thank god. The problem is the three little people. Again. It's just the same thing. Get onto the back. Yeah. Why did you have to come back, Johnny? Oh, I want to come home, Cat. And you got another pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Uh, oh, oh, the packs, Cat. I've changed. Your shoe. Oh yeah. Oh. You get religion. I'm I got lonely. Now. I need your I miss foot. you, baby. I'm never gonna give you another reason to kick me out. I swear. Never's a big word. Feels like I heard it before. This time you're gonna be nothing but proud of me. Look at this hotel suite. I got investors. The ones who just left? Yeah, I'm real proud. They're the ones who broke your finger? Yes. <gasps> Oops. Um, yeah, that was uh, th that was another interesting aspect of this game. It's an interactive cutscene. Even though there's a cutscene going on and the story's progressing, you still have to just, you know, continue platforming, which uh, I think that's amazing, to be honest, because, uh, you, you know, it can be quite difficult to score with, especially if you want to concentrate on the story. But um, you just have to pay attention, really, and uh, I think that's great. The fact that even their actions, just the way they're moving about on the wall there, and, and like for example, like she's lifting up her shoe to tie just to, to fix her heels, and you just have to you have to use that basically to be platformed up. So I think that that's just such a great aspect to it. Why did you have to come back, Johnny? Right. I want to come home, Cat. Let's concentrate. And you got another pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Oh, it's the past, Cat. I've changed. Oh yeah, you get religion. I got lonely. I miss you, baby. I'm never gonna give you another reason to kick me out, I swear. Never's a big word. Feels like I heard it before. This time you're gonna be nothing but proud of me. Look at this hotel suite. I got investors. The ones who just left? Yeah, I'm real proud. They're the ones who broke your finger? This? It's nothing. I got a cot in a desk drawer. In a door. In a car door. 
Remember the horse doctor you were gonna fix races with? That was wrong, Kat, I know that. And the bar we bought, where your friends didn't have to pay and everyone was your friend. Well, you gotta cultivate your clients. Oof. And the strip joint where you got too close to the help? Oh. Now, there you're wrong, Kat. I showed the move, sure, but I never put a hand where it wasn't supposed to go. How can I believe you, Johnny? Your lips are moving. Yeah, Johnny. Every night I dream of the good times, Kat. Tell me you don't, too. A night I don't dream is a good night. Oh, oh that is... I do feel a bit sorry for Johnny. I mean, he is trying, even though he's a complete and utter idiot about it. But um, does his best. And she just had enough of his shit, I suppose. Um, that was great. That little bit there, no, the way. What did you say? Oh, I'm not I know, cause I can read your mind like a highway sign. No, Johnny, not again. You're a carousel of broken dreams. You keep coming around and around. No one is ever gonna love you like I do, kiddo. Get back! Don't try and kiss me, Johnny. I'll lose my mind. You gonna shoot me? Ah, right, go ahead and shoot. Uh -oh. I got two holes in me where you and Dee Dee used to be. Put another one in there. Finish me off. What do you want with Dee Dee? You're not even her real father. What do you think, Vincenzo's oh. real? All he ever gave Dee Dee was her cute little nose. What? Yeah, maybe I'm not her real father, but I'm the one that showed her how to tie her shoes. Oh I'm shit! I'm the one that put her to bed when you had to stay out late. You took her to see his show. Did he change his mind? He doesn't want to be her father. He doesn't want to be anybody. I hate you. Jesus, Cal, what are you doing? Mommy, stop! What are you doing? No, nothing. Mommy and Daddy were having a little fight. It's not a real gun. It's just a toy. Yeah. Yeah, it's just a toy, Didi. Mommy, are you gonna let Daddy come home? Didi. Please, please let Daddy come home. He's in pretty deep with some bad people, Didi. Maybe he should make good with them first. Right, Johnny? Maybe I'm no good without my family. Maybe I need my family to make good. Johnny. Yeah! Daddy needs us! If this is another train wreck, it's not just gonna be you and the train this time. I'm not gonna let it wreck this time. I promise. I've missed you so much. Yay! Daddy's coming home! Oh! Explicit! But DG! He's not my real daddy. Get a room. No, he's not DD. Sorry to say that, but yeah, shocker, look at that. Turns out, uh, the amazing Vincenzo is the the amazing asshole. Really, he's her father. You were no one who was expecting that, really, were you? I mean, there were no hints about it whatsoever, to be honest. So it was a bit, quite a shock, but... Oh, we're back indoors. Dee Dee's bedroom again, I think. I don't remember what I have to do. Do I just click on this again? To continue it? Oh no, that, that was collectible this time. Instead of the lab. And I think in this time, if you click this, it, yeah, it carries on the story. Yeah, it switched from last it's time. It's you! Where have you been? What? Did you know the circus is in town? It's Daddy's circus. Where have I been? He says it's gonna be the biggest thing ever! I just caught here. He always says stuff like that, and then something goes wrong. And Vincenzo's my real daddy. We have to go talk to him. Might not be a good idea, Didi. It seems he doesn't really want to know you. Unfortunately. I can interact with the house first, can't I? Because it's like collectible or something. Yeah, there's this. Yeah, I just pressed this to see. There's all these little letters and stuff and pictures and stuff. I missed one. And it's just that one upstairs. From Cat to Child Services. Please don't take my child away. Yeah, you can read that if you want to. Just pause it and stuff. Um, I think I'll just show these at the end. Oh, Dawn! That's my name. Here we go. I'm Dawn. That's... Which is funny, considering I turned... Dawn is, uh, you know, the beginning of, I suppose, the... When the sun first comes up, and, um... I'm a shadow person by the looks of it. Very interesting. Oh, oh, there's cat. There's Carmine. This is the Carmine Bruni acquitted of murder for second time. This is the guy that Johnny's dealing with. Um, I'll show you all of that. I think at the end. Well, if I even collect them, or to be honest, I don't know if I will. I mean, is this a? Oh, that was for the story. Oops. Oh no. It's an eviction notice. Daddy says he's gonna pay all the bills when the circus is a big hit. 
come on. I want to go find Vincenzo. Act two, the return of the prodigal. Oh, we reached the second act. Get to the circus tent. I do, can I? I can't get this, can I? Oh, this was a collectible. That's all right. I might, uh, so it's not important, I suppose. Now I can get this. Yeah, that's, it's so, that's, quite devious, like this is the story and then it turns into collectible immediately afterwards. And you think the thing upstairs is the story but it is not, so. Um, what time is it? Uh, I don't think they'll hold you. Oh god, no they You'll won't. have to go through shadows. How are they holding you? Oh, B when in shadow to dash through thin shadows. Ah, this is a new ability I have. No, what the fuck is this? Strange, strange. The world is so incomplete. I'm being destroyed. But yes, now we can. Oh, oops. Yeah, through thin shadows such as like these piles. We can now dash through them and shadow form. That tends to happen. Uh, I think I, I think I clicked RT, the, the RT with my. Um, finger a bit there when I was dashing. Jump to shadow. Ah, oh, I got a shadow dash. Oh, I do it in the shadows again. There we go. Hey, there's the circus tent. TD, we're here. There's any collectibles outside? Vincenzo, ready for our big night? People are really excited. You're gonna have to give them their money back. What? We're sold out. You haven't paid me. I got the money. We're selling out. You'll have it before the show. Even if you do, I can't perform here. Your circus is a disaster. It's coming together. Your puppet show about the princess is missing the princess. Oh, You've lost your hot air balloon, and where did you get that pirate ship? It is a broken down piece of junk. Come Jesus. on, Vincenzo, it's opening day. There's always a few wrinkles to iron out. Look, I'll get it all iron. fixed. No problem. Consider it done. All right. But don't think that I will be some sort of shiny bauble that lures people into your scrapyard. Said that wrong. He's so mean. I'll yeah. get it fixed, I promise. I'm glad you're not oh, like him, did you? I'm worried about Daddy. He always says it's okay, but those gangsters really hurt him. We have to fix the circus, so Daddy will be safe. Come on, it's this way. I'm glad you turned out more like Johnny than you did Vincenzo, Didi. She just goes to show. As a matter who you were born from. And on that very philosophical note, I think we'll end the episode here. We are in an area of the game that gets quite busy because there are three different objectives to do like basically at the same time, but obviously you do one but then another and another. But um I will leave the episode here standing in front of this gorgeous backdrop uh thank you for joining me on the second episode of contrast it was a success there was no glitches or nothing and everything went well which i'm glad for uh give a thumbs up thumbs down like subscribe all the usual um thank you for others i suppose uh tell me what you think good bad hate it loved it share it if you want to uh I will greatly appreciate it. Well, I do greatly appreciate it, of course. But um, thank you very much, and um, I hope to see you in the next episode. So, bye.